Yandu, you're not limited to uploading and sharing just standard documents, but video files as well. Since we already have a separate file for videos, let's jump right in to see what's been uploaded so far. Now, video files can be uploaded in all standard formats. Clicking on this right here will open up its page where we'll be able to see which access rights are granted for users visiting this specific file. We can also view any images and files here. In this case, we have the video file that was uploaded. Links can also be added or used to share videos. Tasks can also be created and comments regarding the file can be made as well. Going right into the file, we'll have the chance to preview the video. Set the quality, change the playback rate. And again, we can directly leave comments for the video itself and share information with other users in the project. We can also share or leave timestamped comments. So if we click here, we'll be able to read the comment that was left for this specific point in the video. After reviewing the clip, we can share this video with other users, which can be done right up here, the share via email. We can select the recipients either by using the drop down menu or by simply typing in their names or email addresses. We can also select departments, groups, and even agencies. We can also create or use a stored mailing list if we already have one. Next, we can leave a message for our recipients if we want. Then we have options to send a copy to ourselves and even set an expiration date for the file, which means that the video will only be available for a limited time. Lastly, we'll have other options to customize the layout of the email by changing colors, choosing to display a video preview, and so forth. The advanced settings are not available for all plans, but if you do have the options, you can further protect the file with a password and so on. And basically, whatever changes we make can be reviewed in the preview to the right. And that was a look at how to share video files. Stay tuned for more tutorials on Yamdu features. Hey!